Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, it's Jake, welcome to my channel. And for today's video, we're doing a past unboxing. Yes, as you guys can tell by the title, it's another unboxing video. I couldn't help myself, I was on Instagram, I saw the Wizarding Trunk were doing past boxes, and one just happened to get sent here by an owl, I don't know how. I have heard of the Wizarding Trunk before, mainly from the channels of Cherry Wallace and the Pot Collector, if you love Harry Potter as much as I do, you should follow them, they are two of the best Harry Potter YouTubers on this platform. And... I couldn't help myself. I can't afford a subscription box, but they were doing a pass box and I thought a one off purchase won't hurt. This did take a couple of weeks to come, but because obviously it was coming from the US and it was over by an owl and the owl was called Lupin, my favourite character. How did they know? If you want to stick around and see what is in this box, please do. Remember to like, remember to subscribe. I'm almost at 500. Let's see if we can get me there. And without further ado, let's unbox. First of all, can we just talk about the packaging of this thing? It's so cute. It's like when the Weasleys um, accidentally sent Harry a letter and they didn't know how many stamps to put on. It's so cute. I wish we're all mailed and have to ruin it with the sticker. On this side, it says Magical Post. On this side, you got many, many, many more stamps. How many stamps did they put on this? On this side, it says Fragile Magical Delivery, or as a part of Collector like, likes to say, Fragical Delivery. Oh, on the front, it says, I do hope we put enough stamps on. I will give you guys a peek first. I will not look. I see a t-shirt first off, so I'm just gonna pull that out. I'm not gonna really... This box is full. I've literally just kind of seen it. It's full to the brim. Oh, my sister would love this. She's gonna steal it from me. It's Herbology. Oh, it just says Herbology in this nice kind of wooden banner. And you've got all these different plants and it looks like, a there's like a mushroom one. It looks like a Venus flytrap one. That is so cute. My sister is going to try and steal this from me. She's a Hufflepuff and for some strange reason, she loves Herbology. This is so soft. I've always heard um, the pot collector say these are like buttery soft and they are so soft. I got this in a large, I probably could have got a medium, but I don't mind wearing these as like night t-shirts or just oversized with some jeans. I wouldn't say I apologize for how I look just because I think I'm going through a flare. I'm not sure. There's a pin. <gasps> oh my God, this is, this is just so weird. I was just at Warner Brothers Studio Tour for the Magical Mischief event. Oh look what pin I got. Umbridge on their unicycle, like that is totally, that is weird. Like, I'm gonna, oh, her wheel actually moves, look. That is so cool and it's double clasped as well. Like I'm actually gonna put that like next to my Wizzly, Wizards Wizard of stuff on top of my shelves. Like that is brilliant and it's so shiny. It's like an enamel pin and I just love how her wheel moves. And I love how they made her look like she's supposed to look in the books like a toad. Let's just go for this big box, big box for Ron. Circus presents the phoenix, the immortal, the immortal bird of fire. Circus the phoenix, the immortal bird of fire, has the ability to burst into flames and be reborn from the ashes. I mean, these boxes, come on. Yep, styrofoam normally means something good. Ready? Oh my god. of a phoenix. I'm gonna pretend it's Fox the Phoenix. What the hell? The detail on this is absolutely beautiful. The paintwork, it's definitely made out of clay maybe? Or satin like that. And even like the gold accents on it. Just to, like if I was put it on the sun, it would shine. Oh, I'm gonna to have to find somewhere to put you. Oh, it's what the phoenix? Oh my God, there's so much in here. Only the purest of potions. Black lacewing flies. Okay, let's open it. Oh, there is actually like f flies in here. Ew, there we go, look, there they are. Good thing I have a potion shelf, really. I don't have a potion ingredient at all, so I love that. Oh, it makes me feel a bit weird now knowing there's black flies in here. Oh, oh that's another pit. Two, oh, I've got, I've, I've got two of the same pins. They've given me two of the same pins and I love it because Luna. I saw this pin in one of the Park Collectors videos and I absolutely fell in love with it. It's Luna, I love her. She's got her lion head on. The eye of her hair Patronus is actually like a jewel. Like if you touch it, it's actually risen. It's a jewel and it's so beautiful, I love it. Ah, oh, it's so pretty, but they've given me two. I don't really need to. Grab that one. Oh, it's a key. I think it's... 
potion. I think it's the potion key. It says PS there. Potion, sub, sub, potion, covered potion supplies. I don't know. Obviously, it's got a cauldron bubbling. But it looks like Felix Felicis right here. And the, the little teeth even look like it's holding a vial. It's actually really nice. I actually love like when I see keys in these subscription boxes because they always look really cool. Oh, another thing to go on my potion shelf. Potion supply cupboard. Maybe that's what it stands for. The, I know it doesn't have the C on it, but it says PS, so potion supply cupboard. I don't think it's metal. That doesn't sound like metal. I like the size of it. It's tiny. Uh, it's not too bulky. I'm just gonna go for this thing here. Oh, that is so cute! It's a little Ireland hat from the Quidditch World Cup. It's nice. It's almost like a velvet material, but it feels felty. Like, like, like on this feels a bit more like felt. It doesn't go that. It's like not obviously way wearable. I could probably try and stick it on Clive. Do you want to try and wear this? He's there. No, <laughs> he hates it. Oh, there's still so much in here. I'm just gonna go for this because I can see it. Keep dropping ears. I, as we already know, in a box I got from Depop, I already got a clay version of them. I'm keeping this box and putting it up there because it's very Weasley Wizard Jesus. I've got two pairs of them now. What the hell? I can always just leave these in here. Well, these are bigger though. That's what she said. <laughs> like much bigger. Clay probably again with some like nice painted detail on it. So. I already do have these, but these are, um, I don't know, these are slightly better than the ones I got in, in the box I got in Depop because I think those were made by Geek Gear. Um, they, these are more solid. Those are very clangy. Like when you do that, it's more echoey. Um, so these are nice and sturdy. Obviously, if you did drop them, you would break them. They're perfect because since I was just there for the Magical Mischief event. There's still loads in here. Very thin brown box. No indication of what it is. Ooh, okay. Oh, I've seen this. I saw this in the Potter Collector video. <laughs> it's like a laser pen. Hang on. And a little torch. Lumos. I don't actually know if I would use this at all. Maybe just, um, maybe as a little like reading light. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I think it's a potion. Oh yeah, cool. Blood purifying crystals. Love the packaging, love the label, and then look at all these. It's like basically like probably just like little rubies, gemstones in here. That is so cute. So I'm guessing you probably eat these and your blood purifies, or in case you're poisoned. It's really cute. That's nice to go on my shelf actually. My um, shelf could use a pop of colour, and that's like another little cool thing. That's not a potion. It's more like a remedy. I think I see another key. It's a big junker of a key. This one's huge and I think it's a key ring you can stick it on your keys. Oh, I think it's for Bobaton. Like, this is a chonker. The size difference in the keys. This is thick. This feels like proper like metal. So you've got the carriage there. You've got the Bobaton logo. And then the, the, the teeth are is like a snowflake almost probably like representing the Yule Ball. It's so cute. I love it. I Oh, this is the pouch that Hagrid gave Harry and it only, what is it, you put something in it on, only the owner can get it, I think. Is, if I'm correct, let me know in the comments. I think that's what it is. It feels really sturdy, really well made. You can obviously tie it up with these little things and you could probably t put something in here if you wanted. Like you could even put like a pot or something in there and use it as a plant pot holder maybe. Ha, I know, cute. I have a program, I do not have a ticket! Like, it's in the proper colours, like, wow. I love this. So Quidditch World Cup, I'm coming for you. Now, so I'm, I have to go to gate A, section 312, I'm in row Z, seat 9. Nice, so it's the 22nd Quidditch World Cup. Even, like, the, the foiling, look at that! Nifflers, go wild. It is a bit bendable, like, but of course you're not going to do that. You just got to, like display it oh cool we have a notepad uh i think it's it's a diff it's a dumbledore's army notepad lined looks very worn like made it look old a little bit like with some coffee stains on it you get a few pads in here i think 
that's always handy for having on the table so if i need to write a list i can write it down i will not be writing any dumbledore army meetings on here you never know who's going to be lurking about what is this oh wow this is like a full-blown magazine like what oh my gosh okay so it's nightly nocturne and it's like a full-blown magazine this is what looks like a magazine a death eater would buy bogmar university increases security missing mystery girl back from the dead magical mandates from ma magistration beware of the blue moon oh wow look look at all that that is so cool magistration's most wanted do not approach like wow that is just oh my goodness like i'm gonna have to probably i'll probably will have a proper look through that later other oh, classifieds at the back Spell off, Thug Muffin can help. Azores, Hand of Glory, Ghost for Hire. That is definitely something I'm going to be putting on like my potion slash dark arty shelf because look at that. That is really cool. Like the details in this, amazing. I think we're down to the last thing in here. Oh, I love it. It's a nice kind of watercolored print of the Whomping Willow. So beautiful. I'm gonna to have to frame this and hang it. It's actually beautifully painted. Like absolutely stunning, but there's no clue on who the artist is, but if you've painted that, amazingly. Like, that, guys, that is it. So I'm actually gonna count how many items we actually got. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So I've got 17 items in this box. All of them fairly well made, no damage. I don't know if the Luna pin was meant to be a double. I'm not sure. I will email and ask um, just because I, I don't think they meant to put a double in there. I'm not sure. But apart from that, I'm absolutely freaking delighted. I've got so much stuff that goes with everything I already have to stick up on my shelves. Everything has come well packaged. Nothing was broken. The box itself is like, you want to keep it. Sadly, I can't. And I, oh, I'm just so happy. I can't, I, I think... I think my favourite things, if I had to, if I had to pick a top three, first would be the Phoenix statue, the blood purifying crystals, just because I've never seen anything like this. And I don't have anything like this. Three, not gonna lie, this. Just down to the detail of it, like the effort they've put in to write everything. Like all of this is not just like squiggles. It's actual words. I don't want to pick least favourites because I don't really have any, but maybe this? Because I know you can probably clip it to books and use it as a light. The 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 red laser thing. I'm not going to. I don't know how I'm going to use this. Maybe the hat, just because it looks obviously not as good quality as the other items. That's just that. It's not that I hate it. It's just not as good quality as the other stuff. Getting a double of a pin is never a, a good thing. Um, so I will ask them if it was meant to do that. But no, it's nothing to do with the pin. It's just that. Was I supposed to get another one or did they mean to throw a double of Luna in there? That's it guys, that was me unboxing the Wizarding Trunks past box. What did you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below what was your favourite item. Remember to like, subscribe and I will see you in another video. Bye!